guys, I just want to thank everyone that came through yesterday, even though there was a technical glitch at uh, 6 p.m. live that I did. I was trying to redirect the crowd over to my second channel. You guys actually got over there, but it was a glitch, and we ended up back over to my main channel, which was a good thing. Thank you very much for everyone that came through. You guys came through with flying colors. Um, but yet again, y'all know I've been doing this for quite some time, and I know the behaviors of Carbonation Nature Boy and these Carbonation Girls. I knew we were going to get some sort of a response out of them after they heard me do the live with the allegations of Malia may have left Carbonation and the women have separated. Now, that doesn't mean Malia did not leave. It could be a possibility that she did go home. And we also know that none of, none of them really control one page. So if Malia was to leave, somebody could simply still go onto Malia's page and make a statement that um, a queen would never leave her king. Uh, I guess referring to Nature Boy, which we know is not her king, because a king would not put his wife or his queen into harm's way making her his co-defendant um smuggling drugs with a little uh camera helicopter through a, a jail window so you know they're not looking at the big picture we're gonna get down to the bottom of it if they can surface to complain to us about uh, privileges being taken by poor nature boy even though he's not following the rules and they're not also getting that the, the courts are trying to um, get them away from Nature Boy because neither parties are any good to each other. If Nature Boy was still in the picture, there's no telling what else he would have these girls doing. He may have already had them uh, attempt to rob a bank if he was able to have contact with these brainwashed women. Uh, we're going to stay on their neck um, because. I just feel as though every time something happens, they're always trying to publicize it like Nature Boy is a victim. When we all know that Nature Boy is not the victim. They're not realizing that the reason Nature Boy is not even a like man, um, and in some cases, which hate is a strong word, he's a hated man because of the way he treated them and all the other Carbonation members. And they still yet and still try to clap back on the public the same people that they ask for their Babylon hard-earning money because they don't believe in working. Those same people are the ones that they clap back on just to defend their, their king, their god. And it's so sad that their god, their king, is not being transparent with them and being a man saying, you need to go home back to your families until further notice. I don't know the faith of my freedom. Um... I picked up another charge, which um, um, put me in a situation that made it worse, made me look worse. Uh, whatever I was trying to portray uh, when I was trying to clear my name with the uh, false imprisonment and the R charge, it just made it look worse. The thought of knowing that I planned something like smuggling drugs allegedly into a prison, picked up another charge. I can barely get off of the first charge. There's no bond on the first charge. Um, and I get another $15,000 bond. Uh, even if I do get a bond on the first charge or they do drop the charges, I'm still going to have to sit in here. And they're not looking at the big picture. There's no telling when Nature Boy will get out. Uh, the DA did give him a deal, but the, I don't get, I don't think that they get that. That also could mean I did at one point in time say it could be a positive um, a situation for Nature Boy. It could be that they can't prove the R charge and they can't prove a lot of things, but they're trying to sit him down to set an example that he cannot be um, running these kind of communities and treating people so humane, inhumane. And they want to sit him down because he is a threat to society and history repeats itself. and. They don't want, the system doesn't want the following to get, you know, bigger because then things can get out of control. And we all know what happens with these kind of cults. Um, usually it doesn't end well. So they're really trying to sit him down for the safety of the community. 
And I'm saying, and when I say safety of the community, I'm not talking about our community. I'm talking about with, with, um, within communities and states and, and, and um, overseas, wherever he's able to migrate, he's able to brainwash and have these people follow him and do whatever he wants them to do. And half the time, it's not, um, you know, stuff that, that, that's um, lawful. And we all see that because look at how he got these women caught up with legal troubles. Um, but I got some um, tricks up my sleeve, and I'm also still waiting for um, to hear back from a family member. You know, they were on Instagram yesterday. That doesn't mean that they um, check their DMs all the time. I'm guilty of it as well. I might go on to Instagram and never check my DM for a couple of weeks. Um, so, you know, whether, uh, they get in contact with us or not, you know, I'm going to do some inspector gadget work. I'm going to definitely do my due diligence and I'm going to get down to the bottom of what's going on. Um, I know right now that they're in a, um, stuck between a rock and a hard place because Jax allegedly was arrested for shoplifting. And I know he was a messenger for quite some time now that Juju is still in jail, and I'm assuming he's in jail because we have not heard from Juju. But until these two characters get out to continue to be the messenger and get information over to um, the women because they cannot contact Nature Boy, and as it um, stands from that message that they put out on their Nature Boy TV, that post, he can't talk to anyone from the outside world. So they're really trying to weasel these weasel out of that weasel hole, separate them. Like Aaron Dixon has said, a.k.a. True said on Max V's panel, which was true because I didn't said it. Separate these women from each other. And all they have is, 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 is one. All they have is themselves. And trust and believe they will go running home because I don't think that they're strong enough individually to hold nature boy down um or to be able to support themselves to be able to hold him down um because they're not going to be able to hold themselves down but we're going to see how this plays out yeah i'm back on um this uh nature boy uh commentary and uh seeing what's going on and seeing how this uh fate for nature boy is looking and also you know pulling apart all the fluff and trying to figure out whether or not, if it's true in any way, that um, Nature Boy is going to actually do some time for um, the crimes that he did commit. Because uh, a free man um, doesn't, especially someone that's been publicized um, as much as Nature Boy has in the community and surrounding states and areas, a free man doesn't stay sitting and reject a bond if he is innocent. So we're going to see how this plays out. I will be doing a live commentary video today at 6 p.m. or maybe earlier. But either way, I will set up the live in advance for you guys to know that I am, in fact, going live.